According to Bill Plaschke of the Los Angeles Times, former Los Angeles Lakers head coach Phil Jackson would like to see LeBron James traded from the team. He also mentioned that Jackson would like for the Lakers to keep Russell Westbrook and try to make it work with him. Instead of trading Westbrook, I think they're leaning toward finding a coach to work with him. Um, what about LeBron? So he's got a ton of power, and I think it's a mess. I think the only way out of this, I don't think they can win with LeBron and AD. I don't know what you think. I don't think they. I don't think there's a way out of this. Here's what I think. I think that at the at the end of it, LeBron plays for the Lakers. He's not a Laker, and that's a really all right, a, Doug. That's so you're dead on, and I can tell you live in the area. You get it. He's you're exactly right, and and he breaks. I gotta be honest, and, I, and I'm gonna write this when, when the season starts. I don't care. I don't care if he breaks the record. I don't care if he beats Kareem. I'm not. I don't feel connected to him in any way. And the and the town of L.A. does it either. So my point is, why keep him around just for star value? He can make. He can turn somebody else into a champion. Help you rebuild. Get rid of him. It's it's a it's it's a it's a crazy thing. What what about Phil? I know he doesn't want to coach. I, I understand. And and look, unlike some others, I actually still have hold Phil in great respect. But because of his ability to deal with stars, right? Like that that's the magic to Phil. Magic to Phil isn't just the triangle, okay? The triangle is an offense that was about spacing based upon how the game I felt like used to be it's still a spacing game, but it's it's changed and evolved. But still the the real Phil Jackson was he could handle stars. How would how would he handle this, especially considering he's made some comments before about LeBron and the posse comment, and, and whether or not you like that word or not, it still does ring true. Like, he rolls deep with his guys, and they come in, and they do, and they, they try and run the show. How, how is that dynamic? Yeah, I think, I think we're going to know a lot more about what Phil thinks when we see what the Lakers do. I've heard that Phil would like LeBron traded. I've just heard that. Because of his tight friendship with Lakers owner Jeannie Buss, Jackson is said to have considerable power within the Lakers organization. He is currently advising the organization on its most recent coaching search. Although Jackson has an exceptional coaching history, his managerial judgments have not had the same pedigree. He has also been known to be harsh on James at times, particularly while he was with the Miami Heat. He used to refer to that team's style of play as Xbox basketball and he wasn't a fan of Xbox games or whatever those games are when you play one-on-one. At the end of the day, the Lakers would be foolish to let go of arguably the greatest player in the history of the sport, since his sheer presence not only elevates the team to championship contention, but also fills the seats at Crypto.com Arena night in and night out. James had possibly the best 37-year-old season in NBA history last season, averaging 30.3 points, 8.2 rebounds, and 6.2 assists per game. The Lakers should trade Westbrook and do everything in their power to get as many 3 and D players as possible this offseason. After all, with LeBron James, the Lakers were one of the top teams in the NBA just a year ago. Do you think the Lakers should trade LeBron or Westbrook? Let us know in the comments. 